action. What I have here is the uh, liquid level meter controller, and what it'll do is the sensor the height of the water in your system, the reservoir, whatever you have on your HHO water fuel cells. Uh, right now, you're at the lowest level, it's below the pools. So at this point in time, the relay has been triggered to open a solenoid where it'll be pulled in on a vacuum or to pump. And hits the first pole, so you've got a green, a yellow, and a red. Hits the top, you hear the relay flip. At which time you can use the red light over here and the opposite, the right hand side of that relay, and trigger your system back on. The system will stay on and watch the red light. You get it all the way to the left right now, you're medium, you get red. As it gets to the very bottom, the red will come on by itself. You have the power light when your system comes off. Your relay kicks back over and is running a pump or a solenoid vacuum. Got vacuum on it, it'll pull water into the cell. Come back up. With the red the power system box, so you will really come back down off the top hole. You got yellow and red, caution, and get down below. You don't have red until your system drops power and you know you pops. Uh, pretty self explanatory. Uh, it runs 12 volts to the 16 volts DC, so you can run out in any car, whatever. Uh, Cobalt DC system, and there you go. Uh, if you want to see continuity here, let me show you what we're going on here. Right now, as you see the red lights on, we have a continuity between the pump and the cylinder. Bring it in closer. I can't yeah. see it. I can't see both together. There you go. A little bit closer. There you go. Good. Yeah. yeah. Try right there. I can't hold on to it. Okay, right hand side pumping solar. We're gonna get back up. Left hand side. And yes, I was going to have backwards the first time, but you get the idea. But one way is continuity going one way, and you can see how it's delayed until it reaches the top or bottom of the next one. And it's going to activate and do it the opposite function. Um, that's pretty much all there is to it. Thanks.